Hi guys, greetings of the day. Myself Raghavendra. Today we are going with a lamina problem. A pentagonal lamina having edges 25 mm is placed on one of its corner on HP such that the surface makes an angle of 30 degree with HP and perpendicular bisector of the edge passing through the corner on which the lamina rests appears to be inclined at 30 degree to BP. Draw the top and front views of the lamina. So it is a pentagonal lamina of 25 mm side resting on HP with one of its corner. So corner has to come towards left side. The surface of the lamina makes an angle of 30 degree with respect to HP. That is theta is equal to 30 degree. Whereas the perpendicular bisector of the edge appears to be inclined at an angle of 30 degree with respect to VP. That is phi is equal to 30 degree. As it is bisector appears to be, it is a non-locus problem. So draw horizontal line and name it as XY, VPH. X, Y, V, P, H, P. So it is resting on H, P with one of its corner. Construct like that. Twenty-five. Zero. 25, 72, 25, 72 into 2, 25, 72 into 3. So this is resting on corner. How to construct resting on corner manually? To understand that one, go through my previous videos. So this is 25 mm. Naming A, B, C, D, E. Project the points in upward direction from A to X value. B and E to the XY line, D to the XY line. Now join these points with the thick line. So this will be A dash. This is B dash in the bracket E dash. And this one C dash in the bracket D dash. Show the arrow marks. This completes the first portion. For the second portion, surface of the lamina makes an angle of 30 degree with respect to HP. So, A dash C dash has to make an angle of 30 degree with respect to X O line. So, the angle of this one will be 30 degree. This is A dash. This one is C dash in the bracket D dash. Still, we have to get B dash in the bracket D dash. For that one, the distance will be 14.69. So, A dash has center 14.69 mm as radius. Draw an arc. This point will be B dash in the bracket A dash. Project from each point in downward direction. From A dash in downward direction. Similarly, from B dash A dash downward. From C dash. Down. This angle will be 30 degree. Project horizontally. A is here, A dash is here till this line. B, B dash is on this line till this line. C is here, C dash on this line. D, D dash. E, E dash is on this line.
A, B, C, D, E. So join all the five points with thick line. A to B to C to D to E back to E. Show the arrow marks. This completes the second portion. For the third portion, perpendicular bisector of the edge passing through the corner on which the lamina rests. The lamina resting on corner A, the perpendicular bisector passing through this corner is this line. So it has to make, it is appears to be making an angle of 30 degree with respect to VP. So as it is appears to be, so directly we can take this one. So for that one, first we will draw a 30 degree line. Draw 30 degree line. So the angle of this line with respect to x y should be 30 degree. So as it is appears to be, directly copy this. Draw. This is the perpendicular bisector. So directly copy this one on this line. I'll call this as M. As it is appears to be, so directly copy AM on this 30 degree line. The length of AM is 33.32. So anywhere on this x y line as center, 33.32 mm as radius, join arc. So this is M. The center is A. We got AM. So next we have to draw CD. So CD is perpendicular to AM. And the length MD and MC are same, that is 12.5, because the overall length of CD is 25, half of that one is 20.5. So from M, we have to draw perpendicular line to this AM. The length will be 12.5. The angle between these two should be 90 degree. Similarly, this side also. To the point five. Once again, the angle between this line and AM is 90 degree. So this is C this is d so once we get cd so this will be thick line once we get cd next bc is equals to d that is equals to 22m so c as center 22mm as radius join arc similarly d as center 22 mm as radius, draw another arc. So afterwards, AB is equals to AE. So that is equals to 23.89. So A as center, A as center, 23.89 mm as radius, draw arc. Similarly, opposite side also. A as center, 23.89 mm as radius, draw another arc. Join the points with thick line. C 
see to this end point. This one. So, so this is A. C means this will be B. D. This one is E. Now project the points in a pole direction. Within line. E is here. E dash is on X Y line till X Y line. Before projecting from other points, first draw horizontal line. So P is here, B dash on this line till this line. C is here, C dash on this line till this line. D D dash on this line till this line. E is here, E dash on this line till this line. So this is A dash. B dash, C dash, this one is E dash. Join all the five corners with thick line. A dash to B dash. To C dash, to D dash, to E dash, back to A dash. Show that one. So this completes the problem. Thank you. Please subscribe to my channel.